Don't forget to check out my Patreon where we have exclusive content for groups such as Twice, Seventeen, Red Velvet, Black Pink, NCT, Super M, Shiny, AT, Stray Kids, and so much more along with K-dramas, concerts, and other variety shows. Hey guys, and here today we have um, XG's new uh, mini album. <sighs> we are in this era as we continue going on through life where the mini album is barely a mini album because they've already released half the album so we could have had six songs we've heard three and two of the songs aren't songs we only have one new song now i want to ask you this y'all hate me because of the documentary reactions I don't care. I, I give up on caring if people hate me. Like, I just, I'm past that. We've grown. We've stopped caring what people think. And we're just honest. They put, tell me otherwise. Tell me otherwise. Where's the proof? Bring me the proof. They care more about that documentary than the music. How is it this group has been around, in theory, for like, what, six years? Five years? They debuted a year ago. And yet, they didn't have music planned. They care so much about this group that they have like an eight episode documentary that's literally like eight hours long. And we have, let's count, let's count. Tippy Toes, Mascara, Shooting Star Left Right, Girl Gang, TGIF, New Dance, and Puppet Show. Eight songs. Now, that could be fine, but it's the amount of, like, dedication these girls had. The amount of, like, they, we've seen the struggle. So my mind goes, oh, so he's he's ready. Like, he, he was ready for this group to debut. They were supposed to de debut before, right? So where's the music? I hate when this happens, like, with a lot of groups where it's like, oh, there's this big deal. They're, I've been planning this group, like, with Baby Monster. I don't care about Baby Monster. They're infants. Um, but hypocrite because XG are infants. But I've made it clear I, I don't like how it happened. There's a big deal, like, oh, I've been planning Baby Monster for years. They've been, we've been trying so hard to debut them. Like, oh my god. Blackpink were actually a group that was supposed to debut, right? Like, they, uh, they were around for a bit, but, like, it took a while to debut them. And yet, I'm like, so where's all the stuff you were ready to debut them with? My mind goes, you should have all these songs ready. And if you're like, oh, well, they want to adjust the songs to the members and all that, you don't even have like the backbones of the songs ready where where's the backbones of these songs and i'm not mad at the songs because the songs we were given i'm eating up like i love new dance I'm just learning new like i'm jamming to that like every day tjf love it i love these songs i love girl gang i love the effort put in the songs but my question is you made such a big deal on how much you prepare for this group these girls were working their asses off, and I'm like, what were you doing? I get it. He was doing, like, building the company. I get that. I'm just saying, like, you... <sighs> That's how I feel like with YG. I'm like, you make such a big deal of how much you prepare for this group. But the biggest thing about a group, the thing we love most, to some degree, is the music. The music. But then, where is it? I, I, I'm, I'm saying this like a bit of, I'm jumping the gun here because you know it's only been a year and I think logically the amount of songs we have is sufficient but it's, it's more like the documentary seems to be higher than the music and that's where I don't really like Simon to be fair his name is Simon which reminds me of Simon Cowell who is the bane of my existence directioner here if you liked One Direction you understand what I mean we hate that man Simon Cowell trash um I feel like, a lot of people are going to hate me saying this, I feel like Simon wants all the credit. <laughs> and I feel like he, like I said, he put more effort into that documentary. Who's in that documentary? Simon. 
I care more about the underage girls than the grown ass man. Call me crazy. Um, I just think with all the work they put through to hold this album and release one song at a time and then we get the album and it's only one technically one song I just think that's kind of stupid I just think that's kind of stupid they're not the first to do it they're not gonna be the last to do it I just don't like this new practice you guys let me know if you do you let me know what the advantages are in your opinion I guess the advantage would be they get a big deal with each song but it's not necessarily even that I hate having all these pre-releases. It's more that when you have all these pre-releases that when you get the album, you're technically just getting a song. You're calling it an album release. But we had all the songs beforehand. Like, it's not even like we didn't get to hear the songs until the album came out. The songs have been out, so we're only getting one song. But we'll see. I already know it's going to be a good song. It looks awesome. Goosebumps. Mm -hmm. Welcome. Also, I'm just in general not a fan of intros because I always skip them. I just want to dance. Are we in a womb? We're in the womb. We've been watching XG's uh, three meals a day, by the way. It looked like an eye, but then it also looked like the womb. It's called new DNA, so it's like, are they reborn? What, why'd they use this picture of Harvey? <laughs> oh, she's so cute. A lot of people hating on their hair, but I think their hair is what stands out the best. Okay. Oh, I like when Harvey sings on this type of stuff. Vocal queen. So why couldn't this be a full song? <laughs> I don't understand. The song's literally made you have a chorus. I don't understand. <laughs> I hate companies. I hate them so much. Like, why? This isn't even a song. I'm not even calling it a song. I can't even call it a song. It's it's an intro without being an intro. But we already have an intro. It feels so... In it doesn't even feel like... Like, it just feels incomplete. I'm waiting for the chorus. Ugh. I'm not gonna listen to the song because it doesn't have meat to the bones. So every time I would listen to it, I'll just get annoyed that I'm like, where's the rest of the song? So that's gonna be a skip because it's t it's so good that it's bad because it stops before it gets to the core of the song. <laughs> I question so much of this company's choices. This is gorgeous. Let's go. Me over here, this company's trashed. Then me over here like this is gorgeous because that's what annoys me. I feel like they half-ass a lot of the stuff to put all their effort in one thing. But you can easily balance it. I know I'm not like a CEO, so what I'm saying. But like, I've seen companies do it. I know it is possible. 
I've seen companies do it with cheaper music videos. It's possible. The, the music video's quality has nothing to do with the song's lengths. Like, X-Gene being one minute doesn't... Isn't, isn't because this, this music video is, like, beautiful. And I don't know what the excuse would be for why that song is short. Oh, it's perfect the way it is. We didn't want to ruin it by making it longer. No, like, you there, you can't ruin it because we don't even... It doesn't even have anything to ruin. <laughs> it just needed a chorus. They could have easily made a chorus. A very smooth, silky chorus with Chisa singing. Put it in between the rap. Probably, like, before Harvey does her rap. Like, put it there. Then do the pre-chorus, which would be the end. Put one of the verses before the pre-chorus. So like, the first verse, the chorus. Well, the pre-chorus, the chorus. The second verse, which I think was Hinata. The chorus. Or, one of them could be a bridge. Add a little... Add, okay, we're, 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 I'm gonna show you how to fix the song. Fuck it. Because I need to tell you how easy this would be. It could be a very simple chorus, by the way, because the verses are so thick that a, a simpler chorus would just kind of sound better anyways. Okay, so after Maya... Uh, before Harvey's put this this is the pre wars okay have it be quiet for a minute then have a nice like I want the chorus to be a little bigger than this but still be a chiller chorus and then, after that chorus, I don't know what the chorus would be. I'm not a singer. Um, <laughs> I have lyrics in my head, but I can't sing them, so I can't really tell you what I want. But, like, it, it, it would be a nice, flowy chorus with a bit more bounce to it than this. Then, have Harvey do her rap. I want it to be a vocal chorus. And okay, so then everything the same, but after this, have a nice bridge where I think Hinata should go off. I want Hinata to go off vocally because we know she can sing. And then have the chorus again, but the chorus be bigger. And then I kind of want them to end with like this. Oh, this could be the bridge, actually. This could be the bridge. The bones are all here. Why aren't we filling them with some meat? Anyways, now it's properly. Because, like, I'm just sick of them doing this. And everyone being like, oh, they're already big, so who cares? I'm like, we need to keep them big. <laughs> I do not like this look on her. I like this. What is wrong? Oh my god. What is... This is terrible. This is literally terrible. What is happening? This is visually unappealing. What's wrong with Navy? Oh, yeah, it's okay. This could have been on the Barbie movie. I love that. I don't care what it says. 
it's, it's giving her what's the uh, the movie Oh, my, oh. Sometimes I wonder if it's a disadvantage they always sing in English. This is gorgeous. This is probably my favorite. I like a good snowy music video. I don't know if I like the instrumental too much, but it doesn't like bother me. Everyone else, I like their outfits. Y'all are boring. It's giving like second gen, like 21 and stuff like that. This is gorgeous. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, these white outfits. They're not boring. They're actually cool. See, this is where you can do like all black or all white and like just make the textures and the shapes better with with her hair. That does not look good on her. Is that Jed? Like, like, I'm not even saying it's offensive. I don't know if it is. I'm just saying it looks bad on her. It just looks bad on her. <laughs> it looks terrible. I really base at these girls up sometimes. <laughs> okay, like the longest outro ever. Okay. <laughs> okay, um... I like the song. I would say I like the other songs better, like TGIF and New Dance, but I understand why this one is, uh the official I guess tile track I don't get what was going on was this Maya who's uh, what is I think it's Jodia what is with the shark teeth like is that a thing I thought they were like those jewels people put on their teeth not grills not even grills it's like those jewels that just look like people have something on their teeth which i have not seen look good on anybody but i don't what's with her teeth because her teeth aren't like this it's, it's a bit distracting <laughs> let me check okay oh, hey, there is a mm. Jordan, or when Harvey appeared with black teeth, I didn't see that, but Jordan had sharp teeth. Okay, so let me know because I really, I saw like one thing where apparently where to go. There was like something, a Japanese cultural thing, which I've never heard of, but hey, obviously I'm not Japanese. Um, where to go? Harvey was sporting well I that was Harvey I'm, I'm thinking more of Jordan's part but apparently it reminds them of Ohaguru a historical Japanese custom to blacken their teeth it was seen as a beautiful thing which obviously I never heard of because you know <laughs> um but that's interesting I didn't notice Harvey having black teeth let me know apparently she was probably wearing grills that's what people were saying but I don't 
what kind of grills look like that. I don't know. This one. Whatever. If it's something cultural, let me know and I'll apologize for the ignorance. Um, I think if they're going to be a global group, though, I'm not saying they have to accustom to the world, but <laughs> I, I, it would be a bit shocking to a lot of people if it's something like, I, I don't know. I, I do think maybe just, I don't know. Actually, I don't know what I'm going to say. I wasn't sure what to because I it, it it just kind of threw me off and took me out of the song a bit. Some people said it referenced the lyrics too, which I guess it kind of did, but it was still a little odd. Um, but let me know and yeah, let me know what you think of the whole thing of that I said about the list of songs and everything. I think the issue is we had Girl Gang like three months ago, so it's not even a new song. And I think it was TGIF before. Yeah, TGIF came out like a month or two ago and new dance came out nearly a month ago so none of these songs are even new we're only getting one new song and it kind of just bothers me but whatever anyways i'll see you guys in the next video bye